Wide on the guy. Ew. Ram down, down. Ran in and down, down, man. Time flies like you wouldn't believe. And I, the great Clark Tempest, am about to prove it. Eighty years ago, my great-great-grandfather buried a time capsule in this exact spot. And today, I've been tasked with digging it up. Let me just get my trusty shovel here. And get a load of this. This here time capsule has been unopened for 80 years. Let's see what relics from the 1940s are hiding in here. Wow, that stuff looks prehistoric. Do you suppose the time capsule was buried when dinosaurs still existed? Well, no, it's not quite that old. Amazing. Look, a phonograph and a Louis Armstrong vinyl. Oh, and a slinky. My grandparents had a phonograph. And we'll be right back after these messages. Mm. What's going through your head, Jimmy? I'm going to make my own time capsule. Well, go ahead. Nobody's stopping you. Oh, yeah! Kids these days, they've got so much energy. Hmm. So, what's on the collecting agenda for tonight? Oh, there's a small business that's at risk of going bankrupt. No worries, small business. Cassandra Collector will strike again. Jimmy, what are you doing? I gotta get some stuff for the time capsule. Time capsule? Uh, wait a minute. I know for certain that this is valuable. Jimmy, wait! Uh, what's wrong? That vase is a collector family heirloom. Please don't put it in your time capsule. I don't want you to get it dirty when you bury it. Fine, I'll go put it back. Jimmy! Did you get your mom's vase? Sorry, Lucy, but it's a family heirloom. We can't bury it. That's okay! I brought some other things to put in here, like these baseball cards that used to belong to my brother. I just so happen to have here an actual baseball. It's my old one, though. Boom! Wow, good throw! Doo. Well, I'll be darned. You kids actually are making a time capsule. Oh, Lucy's helping you? Hi, Mrs. Collector! After all, if Clark Tempest can do it, so can we. Goodness, uh... Carry on, then. Mm. Jimmy's always had a bad history of emulating whatever he sees on TV. He only wants to do this whole time capsule thing because of Clark Tempest. It was really bad other times, like when he wrecked his bike after seeing a professional biker stuntman. Or when he tried to travel back in time after seeing Back to the Future. <laughs> Jimmy, that's just a replica. It can't actually travel through time. Don't ruin my hopes and dreams with reality, mother! But then again, a time capsule doesn't sound as harmful. Whoa! There's a lot of things in here already! I think this should be enough. I agree! Except we should also add this gold medal I found at a second-hand store! Holy moly! That'll totally be worth lots in 80 years! Let me just write something on the box. Because whoever digs up this time capsule will want to thank us for making them rich. And I don't want to wait until I'm 87 for that. <clears throat> Excuse me, but are you Jimmy Collector? Uh, who's collecting my jelly beans? I just want to thank you. Your time capsule from the 21st century made me rich. And I thought I'd loan some of my earnings to you, kind sir. Eh? Good point. Let's get 
this capsule into the ground! Okay. Mm -hmm. So, burying the thing now? We sure are. It's about to be buried right now. I'll be rich in no time. So, kid, ready to go? What are we doing tonight, Mom? There's a small business that we gotta help out. Oh, boy! Eureka! Woof, <laughs> woof,